It's been one week now since four people were shot at Independence Center Mall. A pregnant woman died. KMEC 9's Brian Johnson is live after speaking with the victim's friends. Brian? Kelly, friends say they want to see more charges or more serious charges. Now that their friend has died, they say Carla Brown can never be replaced. They say Brown was a fun, kind, quiet person and that she loved to shop. They say she would go and get her finger and toenails done. Friends and uh, Brown would go to the mall nearly every weekend. Now, police say Friday, two groups of people began arguing inside Independence Center. Then shots were fired. Brown was shot in the head. Police say Thursday loved ones took her off life support and she and her unborn baby boy didn't survive. She's just that person that you can call and talk to for anything and she'll sit there and listen to you and tell you her advice on whatever, you know. Carla just had a good heart too. Like you could call her just at the middle of the night. I need a ride. She's right there. Such a heartbreaking story. Now the loved ones have set up a GoFundMe to pay for medical and funeral expenses. If you'd like to help, the link is at KNBC.com. In Independence, Brian Johnson, KNBC 9 News. Mark Anthony Greer is charged in connection to the shooting. He faces a charge of unlawful use of a weapon and three counts of armed criminal action. Police say Greer was shot in the back. Officers are still investigating what happened and reviewing surveillance video of the shooting.